The ABC 15 investigators are taking a closer look at that Gila River Bridge and what federal inspections say about the safety of Arizona's bridges and roadways. We take bridges for granted until something like this happens. Traffic diverted at Riggs Road after eastbound lanes at I-10 shut down. The problem? Concrete giving way and exposing rebar. The ABC 15 investigators dug deeper to take a look at the bridge's condition. The Federal Highway Administration rates bridges in three categories, poor, fair, and good. This bridge was, was rated fair, as is the bridge carry traffic in the other direction, which is not surprising for a bridge if it's a... Steve Elliott, spokesman for the Arizona Department of Transportation, says this two-lane bridge is going to be replaced with a three-lane bridge. We have a, you know, a much better uh, situation coming. Overall, Arizona has over 8,500 inspected bridges. 1% are rated poor, 35% fair, and 64% are good. We discover holes in the deck where you can see blue sky. An investigation last year by Scripps News found more than 14,000 bridges across the country ranked in poor condition for at least a decade. 56 Arizona bridges are in this category, mostly in rural areas. Poor condition doesn't mean a bridge will collapse. Kent Harries is a structural engineering professor at the University of Pittsburgh. It means it needs attention. It, needs, it means it needs repair, retrofit, rehabilitation, and in a few extreme cases, replacement now. Bridge repair and replacement is a key part of President Biden's push to improve infrastructure. They're going to fix them all. Not a joke. This is going to be a gigantic change. But funding for that push will continue to be a challenge. If you want to see whether a bridge you regularly drive is rated poor, go to our website, abc15.com. We have a list of the bridges there. I'm investigator Ann Ryman, ABC 15, Arizona.